there is no perfect constitution anywhere in the world. I am of the firm opinion that as we go, we'll begin to see the flaws. And those flaws, we need to make amendments and changes to them. But you see, the thing, the, the, the main thing really is this. It's not the piece of document that is called the constitution that really, really matters. It is how the people, it is the values that we do have as a nation, in uh, which we bring about in the process of governance. Now, I, I'll tell you what. If the values that our leaders do have and which they bring into governance are the, the kind of values which the previous leaders, like um, Chief Obafemi Aulo, like um, the Sadana Amadou uh, Belo, yeah. and um, the Owele of Unicha. Zik. Chief um, Azikui. If it was the same values that they had then, which made them to give their all, then we're not going to be having these issues of, oh, this constitution is not right. Oh, uh, the Idomas are oppressing the Igalas, mm -hmm. or the Yorubas are oppressing the Ijebus, or the, I mean, just to, mm -hmm. to use, uh, I'm not using any particular example. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying one uh, group mm -hmm. oppressing the other. The other. Mm -hmm. If we do have our leaders operating with what selflessly, you call, uh, selflessly. Mm. I, I'm told Sadana died without a single house that could be termed his own. Um, Tafa Balewa, uh, I'm also told, uh, probably had just one house. Now, if, 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 if we have, if we still have such people in governance today, then all these hues and cries about um, the, the provision of the constitution would not be as much as what it is right now. But be that as it may, the issue is that today we have a constitution. Mm. If it is not perfect, we have an opportunity to amend the same and to bring it to the point or to uh, the type that we would or that we, we do really want.